What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. Thanks to Sony, as always. Into the boat we go, and away on our journey. Rox Riddle. Could the answer be... Nothing. What gets bigger, the more you take away? Nothing. Uh, I don't think so, brother. Hmm. I do not like riddles. <laughs> and then we'll go do this bay thing. We're going to do as much as we can here. I just gotta find. It. See, the thing is, I feel like the the flame, the, the either the the chaos flame or the uh, the thing that I need to. Oh, what are you doing? Why are you trying? Either to level up my chaos blades or level up my axe. I feel like that's story progression. It's usually story bosses where I'm getting that stuff from. But if I'm pushing for story bosses, that also means I'm not. Must be the statue Dublin was talking about. His hammer must be nearby. It also means I'm not getting uh, the stuff that, that I want. I'm not, I'm not going to be able. If I decide to continue with the story, it's going to force me back what into creature is that? Dragon. Dead. It's going to force me back into to Atreus time. And I'm going to be sad. I don't want to do a trace time. I, mean, I guess I could try pushing the story just enough to get an upgrade to where I'm at that uh that level. Because that's the biggest thing right now, man. If I had literally just like one more upgrade to push my level higher. Is someone there? Please. I could handle all this shit. Well, to put it simply, treasure. The cash just over there, to be precise. My son and I, we, we came to these isles to uncover its riches. I feared it was too dangerous, so I came along and was, well, seemingly proven right. Is that why you haven't moved on? My son, I suspect he went in search of the second half of the treasure. Please find him and tell me his fate. If you require a reward, you may help yourself to the treasure. It doesn't matter to me anymore. We were sailors once. We left Midgard to seek our the fortunes. Are old. His son is surely gone. It costs us little to make sure. Really? And that thing straight up just ignored me and said stop. I'm only gonna give this like one more attempt. I ain't I ain't fighting. It's not a problem, man. These level sixes. Fighting level sixes, I'm still level four. It's not fair. And there's level sevens out there that we've encountered. Well, alright, that that Come that on, one Pedro, didn't count because I was about to didn't work. Out. I was gonna grab grab the uh, the nightmare and then chuck the nightmare at the level six and blow it up. Fighting level sixes, that's all this comes down to. Like, I have killed a level six, shit ain't easy.
Brother, another rune slate. Kind of cool. Durland Hammer. Still in one piece after all this time. Unlike Durland's resistance, I suppose. We will take this to him. About the uh, other quest, is that the, the lost treasure? Okay. What is this episode? What is this? Just ask Petathon? It's bullshit, man. I also don't know how I feel about my new, uh, my new exploding. Right. Oh, you bitch. All right, I need to pop their, 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 uh, I guess it's called physical barrier. That shit is strong. Uncomfortably strong. Like one spear popped it before. Get off of me! Why? Why? Why is it so much to ask for enemies to just not one-shot me that are basically the same level as me? Except they're not, because I'm still level 4. Bullshit. You wanna play like this? Fine, we can play like that.
Don't see him. One exploding smoke cloud can set off another, so make sure you've got a safe place to be when you set them off. A great tool for detonating smoke clouds once you clear the blast area. Your whiplash will blow them up. It's a good little tip. Hmm. Keep that in mind the next time I gotta fight one of these shits. Um. Oh, fuck, no. Hang on a second. Oh, never mind, it's right here. Well, let me pop up this. I thought maybe I had to detonate that thing in the middle of the fight. I heard a raven. Did y'all hear a raven? I sure as shit heard a raven. I wonder if I can pierce a raven with a spear. The broken Muspelheim seat is now. Yo. We should find a mystic gateway. Perhaps we'll find Surtur's combat challenges. Yeah, sounds good to me. Let's go. I like that. Because I don't know. If, what's the... That goes super far. That's going to be fantastic for... Wait, did we not kill the Noken? I guess we didn't. Poison at your back. Oh, that's some bullshit, dude. That no can kill your friends, brother. I know, but I have no way to hit it. This is, it's, I, think, I think this is bug. Like, because the Noken is hiding inside a spot where I literally cannot damage it. That's, that's just, that's bullshit. But I know what I'm going to do this time. Where's that, uh... Who else wants some? Big smack. picked that skill up I wasn't sure about it I was like we'll see I'm very much liking it <laughs> that's 100% that was a good pickup um let's see what else yeah primed maybe or do I just snatch up let's go let's go with these two the evasion attacks are always they're just good to have you know well, I could have made it out There's another thing up ahead. Oh, what? Oh, did we free something? Or Mustunga? Coming at you. 
Is this what we're fighting? What the fuck, dude? Brother, get up. Brother. This is a boss? This is this dinky little guy? I mean, he certainly hits like one, but so does every other damn enemy in the game on Gimme God of War. I'm gonna keep chucking these things at him. my frost laser only because it locks me in place longer than I would like. Are you not what is happening here? Oh god oh god what the fuck? He's like continually trying to boost his level up. other light attack I would use. It definitely doesn't like it doesn't um like even though it says it has high damage, it, it it's the same as like the breath of Thomer. Like it's not the true damage. It does damage fair amount of frost and knockback. Damage I don't like this one. I don't like that one. The golf swing there's Eight thousand seventy-two, nine thousand. I think there's like one more that I don't have. I think I feel like five, five for each sounds about right. Yeah, probably. I like this guy, like that. The put a bomb in him thing. That takes too long. Cool, but. I like that, but I like the stab use more. I like that, but it also takes a lot. Um, this is gonna be lots of burn and four damage. This is gonna be, it's gonna add more stun to the mix. Damage and burn. I'll go back to Neiman. There's just something about that. It's a big ass clap. I do like Fog of Fimble Winter. And I was liking spin to win. The golf swing just seems so just okay. Just the amount of frost to have a supply as well as the maximum duration of the beam. Things to not let it do anything, so keep it in a corner. Whoa, what the fuck, dude? Oh, 
God damn it. That was working super well, and then it's like... It's just a slippery little lizard, dude. It just did... Blah, 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 blah. It was gone. Fuck. I had it. It was there. That's the that's the play. So, even with perfect parries, I can only... I'm gonna have to perfect parry, perfect parry, perfect parry. This might actually be the type of fight where tower shield would be good. Just block, build it up. stupid thing this is the most annoying boss i have fought and we have only taken like three attempts against this but i would rather fight the 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 giant massive bosses that i had to tickle down over this slippery little shit that's not fun he's i don't i don't like evasive little woohoo look at me go i don't like that i don't like you I think the other the other problem here is every time this thing moves, the game forcefully drops my lock on from it. It's just like, oh, it's on the other side of the screen, so we're just gonna fail lock on. And then I need to, you know what? I needed to do my uh, my quick turns. I need to do that. Or what's the? Uh, I can do the the touchpad. What's what's the button? So there's a button for quick turns as well. down all right let's go I shouldn't have counted towards anything. Stay in the corner. Stay in the corner. What was that? I popped my rage and I just died. What the fuck? I do think I need to use these bomb things more. Cause that that bomb took a chunk off that asshole. Right. 
as long as I don't stand and let that hit me in the face, I should be okay. I mean, I'm pretty sure I can dodge while holding that thingy. That might even be the way to beat his ass. Just use these bombs. Get for, get for chunks once he gets low. Yeah, we can do this. Dude, he's so quick with it. That just doesn't care, dude. I, it's so... There's, there's times in this game where the the balance around poise and hyper armor are just completely whacked out. It's also inconsistent, I noticed. Like, right there. Like, usually my stab almost always interrupts somebody. There. Good time. Stab didn't do any interrupting. Like, how? How is he getting off his... How did he just get off the level enhancement while under attack, dude? Like, this is so fucking blurst. I'm in the middle of attacking him. He's being hit by the, the Fimble Winter Wave. Still doesn't... Nope, I'm gonna... I'm gonna up level. I'm gonna boost myself up to a higher level than you. In the middle of this fight. Ignoring everything you're hitting me with. Didn't matter. This is this is. Oh, I am not happy about this thing, man. As much as I want to like properly explore this zone, honestly, I think after I kill this thing and we finish this side quest, um, until my weapons are a higher level, no, just not. But just it, and it's like a catch twenty two because if I explore the zone, I'm gonna find a lot of really cool upgrades that are things that I definitely want to play with. Probably. At the same time, if I don't explore, or so, I need to explore the zone to get the cool upgrades that I want. But, if I wait until I'm a high enough level to properly uh, explore the zone and not be, like, under level for it, by that point, I've probably done the majority of the game. So it's like, oh, I'm glad you waited to explore the zone. You know, there's not much left. We've used up most of the, uh... It's, it's, it sucks because right there does didn't care didn't care at all typically that i see that move stagger people here no no it's just no you're not staggering me stop it's gonna smack you in the fucking face get down why like if it was just consistent if it was like oh he's glowing red i can't stagger him while he's glowing red that'd be one thing that's not what this game is doing fucking break man Ah! 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 Ah!
Put that tongue back in your fucking mouth. Nope, 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 he's still got the level off. And then I get the pair, like, dude. Uh, this guy is, is uh, I'm just gonna just fucking play with my spear, I guess. And just try and spear stun him into oblivion. I do the best when I'm focused on one weapon, I think, for these boss fights. That unblockable comes out like instantly too. Like he jumps up and if you don't dodge, you're done. I mean shit, I've, I've dodged twice and it still hit me. Oh, god damn. Pretty much as soon as he jumps in the air, even. I think when he jumps in the air, it's done. You need to you immediately dodge. No, man, I've got to <laughs> Dude, I can't. I can't. This fucking thing. I think it's more frustrating than any other boss I fought too, because like this guy's not unique. I fought these things before; they were annoying when I fought them before. But for one of them to suddenly be a named, right here, your head's in the fucking way. For one of them to suddenly have a name, or Ormstanga. That might be hang on, that might be the name of these enemies. These theory. Are there something called an Ormstanga here? I didn't even see those attacks happening. I don't even want to go near him. Thank <laughs> you. 
Codex. <sighs> I've fought these before. I fought them before. They're under monsters. They weren't called Ormstungas, but they're these things. Wicked Grims. Cursed Grims. God, that's so fucking annoying. You know, burst of speed and travel and increased distance when invading. Please don't be like a level seven that pops out. Get him get in the box. Got him. Another one already? Great. What exactly do you keep popping up, little one? Does your boss have you spying on us? No, 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 no. That wasn't our intention. You must believe me. I am sorry. Next don't time I'll try to be more helpful. Huh? Gale Henry. Spark. The tunnel must open Leaving up remnants of a Gale Spark. Collect six to restore it to its true form. from here, brother. It feels like we're in the right place. That's the treasure. Damn, that's a lot of work for a fucking side treasure. Quite the sum there, brother. We will find the gold side. Really? His request isn't a distraction? He does not know his son's fate. I see. Okay, then. Mm. I think I know where that's at. That's back when I came here with, uh, with the boy, and we were doing all sorts of moving the thing around. Um all the way out up there. Let's go, uh... Let's go over there. I think that's where the next thing is, too. Brother, can you finish what you are saying about the Oracle of your homeland? Bounty? Helped you against the God of War because you had visions that the God of War would bring down Olympus. Yes, and in defeating Ares, I became the God of War. But enough of that for now. That story is never going to get finished. Another incomplete rune slave. Now I just need to speak the word. Mekin. <sighs> Success. The gate is lowering out there. Yes, let's go where it lowered. If he starts that story up again, I'll just let it play out. Meeting the Lady of the Forge really brought back some memories. I thought it was only in my homeland you'd see such things. Mermaids who forge weapons. Aye. I remember very fondly a late note called Nimue. Very talented with a sword. Maria. I meant that literally. Shame on you. 
She made the best swords in all the Isles, and had big dreams about what she'd do with them one day. I wonder what became of her. I get on this island. There's lots of shit Father, to do here. Can you finish what you were saying about the Oracle of your homeland? She helped you against the God of War because she had visions that the God of War would bring down Olympus. Yes, and in defeating Ares, I became the God of War. In the end, I proved her vision of doom correct. So the Oracle herself brought about the very future she hoped to avoid. I suppose we're in fine company at that. Didn't see a. Has to be something with that. It's that to get across somehow. Another raven right there. It's two ravens, and there's a jump pad right here. There's all sorts of shit over here that I can probably take advantage of. Something else I recall about that Greek play I mentioned, if you won't take offense at a critique. As a worker performance, it consisted almost entirely of watching people give speeches and receive terrible news. Might have been nice to see more events dramatized instead of. Never mind that. Time to fight. We're not doing any more of this shit. If I die instantly from behind one more time. Ah. Right side, brother. Oh, I swear to God, I'm at full fucking health. Am I not? Like, I'm not noticing my health dropping. Am I being, am I being one shot? By that thing? We're not playing that game again. You're gonna fucking die before you get to move, dude. Is it? Is it just gonna outclass me? Or I'm over three on these things. I'm tired of trying to fight things that are two levels higher than me. Not. But if I trigger a fight and it has two levels, nope. Walk away. Come back. 
Because there's no point with me struggling on something that I'm under leveled for on the game hardest Father. difficulty. Speak, spirit. Is that Father? I can't see you. I wasn't quick enough. I'm so sorry I abandoned you. Your father is dead. What? How? He went to find the other treasure on his own, to spare you the dangers. It seems that in your efforts to protect one another, you each came to one of these islands on your own, and... I've been such a fool. But... Thank you, for telling me. Perhaps now, we can see each other again. What a shame. In their attempt to spare the other, they both perished. There is a lesson there. What now? We will retrieve the treasure, then return to the father. What for? To finish what he and his son started. That water wheel's getting no water. Yeah, I see that. I'm never going back to the axe again for those. Something appears to be atop that island. Perhaps the treasure the spirit spoke of. Stop squirming. I'm doing a pretty good job of you getting these little Master buggers. Kratos, a spectacular job. Keep it up and you'll become an expert in no time. I can't tell if he was patronizing or if that was just plain sad. Both. We could use that lift, but not while it's up there. Wait, what? There's a gear, see? Connected to the gate.
I see. A little back and forth for that one. Brother, the wee bastard's about to explode! What is in this chest? Besides the quest thing. Little Vigor cell. Probably worth Quite the cash. I see why it meant so much to our lost treasure seekers. <laughs> Perhaps we should go tell the father what became of his son. What's left is the Berserker, which we're not getting. And Drusil Rift. Remember what was on that Rift? Oh, was that the one that might have been the one that was up top? Where it was just like that level 6 thing that pops right out and tries to smack you? Mimir, the large dwarf statue we saw, who does it depict? All these Stonefoot, Warden of Spartalfine. He used his wisdom and might to imprison some of the most dangerous creatures in all the realm. Oh. Be a little bit of a bitch to get back over there. Go all the way around. Anything else up here while I'm over here? Wow. I wonder if I could hit the, uh... Those ravens and an artifact. I know where the raven's at. Let me see, maybe I can hit the raven now, or, uh, I don't remember if there was a, a thing up here for me to traversal that I needed. But if nothing else, I might be able to just charge throw and snipe the raven. God, I love that so much. That's so, that's so fucking good. Oh, something's gonna be a pain in the ass? Yeah, no. no not today, you're not. Get the fuck out of here with that. I will chuck spears at you until you are popped. In retrospect, I almost wish I had just ignored all the ravens until now. Anyway, we got that. We are planning on... Brother, you don't like riddles, eh? No. Oh, you just haven't heard any good ones. Here. I'm tall when I'm young, short when I'm old. What A happened? candle. Yeah. Heard that one before? No. Oh. Well, did you like it? No. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Did you make the spear? Wait, no. Brock has to be the one to tell me what happened. Shit. I'm just gonna pretend I was never here.
can. Let's do it. Huh. That, Will that finally put me. Oh, we're finally. Very good. We are finally at level five now. Jesus Christ! It took forever. Gonna keep it spatter free this time, right? Kratos. Wear it with pride. Oh, got time to chat? I don't have time to do things. Thanks for grabbing that for us. Melee damage when the permafrost emulation or maelstrom skills are charged based on his rune. Anyway, we're about to wrap this up. I want to turn in this uh, quest to the father, and then I want to go give Durlin his hammer, and then we're going to close on out. Brother, somewhere out there there's a riddle you'd enjoy, and I'm going to find it. Do not. Once spoken, instantly broken. What am I? Silence. Correct! It's here, right? I was not answering the riddle. <laughs> oh man. What is this? Oh yeah, it was up here. Son. Oh, please, tell me. He died trying to find the other treasure. He didn't know you were doing the same. No, no, no. This is my fault. He disobeyed your wishes. Yes, because that is what sons do. I should have brought him with me. We'd be alive and rich beyond all reason. Together. Don't blame yourself. He is at peace. Nevertheless, thank you for finding him. I'll seek him out in Helheim. I'm glad we did this, Kratos. Yes. And I'm sure Atreus will be as well. Yes. <laughs> 3,000. Curious brother, why don't you like this way? They are frivolous. They encourage lateral thinking. Listen, there are three doors before you. One contains a pit of spikes, one a dragon, and one a pair of lions that haven't been fed in weeks. Which door do you open? <laughs> the first. Pit of spikes is easily avoided. Ah, you should pick the third. Because lions that haven't been fed in weeks would be dead! Eh? Mm. I like this riddle. Part of me wants to ride on back and try to fight one of those things now that I've gained a level, but at the same time, I'm like scarred from it from so much. The crazy thing is now if I get no, yeah, even if I bumped them up to five, I'd still be, I'd, I'll be five for a while. But being finally five is huge. Because all the stuff that I was struggling with that was like just barely out of scope, I could definitely take out now. And the stuff that was sixes that there was no way I was going to beat, I have a chance to beat. Put them! You found it! Go hammer. Thanks! Might not mean much with Odin's goons stomping around the city, but folks see this and they'll know we haven't completely given up. Not yet. 
The spirit of rebellion. I got a trophy for that. Must be something See real good. A good reward. Mountain splitter, light runic attack, repeated long range wind slices that stagger enemies. Press R1 precisely while slashing to enhance each wave. Ooh, that is a massive difference. This is 1 1 1. This is 3 2 1. I have max damage. I have the equivalent of 9 at max. That I have the equivalent of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 at max. That's, that's huge, and it's big damage. Let's try it. I'm excited for that. That, that sounds badass. Uh, Alright, but looking at the map, we have, uh, you know what? I know we're already over an hour. Um, real fast. Real fast. Only one attempt. We're gonna warp right on over to that other Berserker Gravestone. And we're gonna see how scaling feels. Yeah, fancy a riddle. Now that I'm the right level. Fancy a boot to the head. Riddle solve. Quick in and out. Because I was really close to beating this guy. This is one of those cases of like, oopsie, you made a mistake, you're dead. And the hope is that now that I am level five, and this thing doesn't have a level advantage anymore, that the fight will be more fair than it was previously. Not here? That's not like right here. It was up top. Ah. <laughs> Given how far I am ahead, I could actually afford to, like, hold off and then do a live stream episode, but... I don't know. I feel like every now and again a long one like this, people end up actually enjoy. Master feel the callus! For the king! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's close. Kill one of you and find out what I get. What's my reward for beating the shit out of you? Now, I can definitely beat these now. I just I got really sloppy there. Didn't have the uh, the warm up of you know multiple matches in a row, but. Fuck me, 
man. I accidentally used that. Damn, blind parry, get absolutely fucked. Still getting a pretty good shot in. I think it makes sense to blow through all of my stuff at the start and then just focus the spear. Always gotta wait for the one two. I can't try and get out of parry after the first one. Or a parry one, block one. And that one always has to be parried. Healing out of this. Come on, 
up in the air. That's so fucking bullshit, dude. Literally beat his ass that fight, and then at the very end, uh, you know what? He's almost dead. We're gonna give him a hyper armor, even though this move has interrupted him every fucking time you've done it. We're gonna give him a hyper armor for this one. This time he gets hyper armor. And he's gonna kill you, by the way. Like, fuck you, man. This is bullshit. Do I know why this game doesn't give 10 out of 10? Because of shit like that. Literally fucking parry god levels of gameplay here. And then the game's like, oh, you know what? He did good, but uh, he gets he gets the hit here at the end. Like, it just, it doesn't feel fair at all when that shit happens. Because it feels like I've done, I am, I am very much playing by the, uh, the boss mechanics. And instead, I'm being punished for it. Like, I have this guy down to a fucking science and it still doesn't matter because he gets to do some bullshit like that. Bar. I'm gonna get a full heal while I beat your ass. Don't run. Oh god. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Doesn't matter. I swear to God, this is so incredibly fucked. Oh, before me! 
Second one, and do it a second time. Yeah, you do. Any more of these ghostly berserker tossers? Give them the same. You'll be doing the nine realms a favor. Did these Asgard warriors wrong you with some Slaughtered into the amulet. Asgard's fortitude. Use the damage of all Kratos' weapon triangle abilities based on his cooldown. Cool. You're quite agitated, even for you. No need to rehash ancient history if it's all the same to you. Very well. Ah. All right, we are wrapping up here. I don't, I, I never meant for an episode to go this long, but either way, that cheating prick is dead. And yes, I'm gonna say he cheated because he always managed to just squeeze one more fucking drop of hyper armor out of his little asshole as soon as he was down to 10%, and that's bullshit. Anyway, we're done. Wrapping up here. I will catch you next time with more.